I just thought I'd make a uh, video on what my breakfast looks like in the morning. Um, I did about 16 ounces to 24 ounces of milk. Um, this depends on what all I'm putting in there, but today um, I'm just putting in a, an apple. I've already peeled it. Um, got the peanut butter smooth. I like the crunchy because it has a diff different taste, but I still have to blend it up. Um, and then, of course, uh, I got whole milk. I've tried those fat milk because I go through about a gallon a day in just about. And this is all I eat for the past uh, almost nine years now. Um, but uh, we put in a about 16 ounces of milk, there's a little line there that says 16, so I'll do that. Um, I also use a magic bullet, but since I'm stitching so much stuff in there today, I'm uh, using my big blender. Um, if you put the magic bullet in there, you've uh, got two, I see. Oh, two, two, three tablespoons of peanut butter. And uh, all I'm going to do is about tasting my finger. I'm trying to get every little last bit of peanut butter off of my spoon. And I'll set that over there. Then of course my apple. I don't stick the whole thing in there. But, uh... If I find me a knife here. <laughs> and, uh... Well, I'll have to sit you down for a minute. I'm not able to do this with one hand. But, uh, I do cut up the apple to uh, make it blend a little easier, a little faster. Instead of sticking big pieces in there, just kind of cut it up, put it in the blender. I cannot eat the peelings, uh, even though I blend them. Uh, the peelings seem to stretch my throat. The radiation has really got to me. Um, Well, I was going to say, I didn't say yet, but yes, about 40% of my tongue is uh, cut out due to cancer, radiation, and chemo. Um, like I said at the beginning, um, I do not eat the solid food. So, there you go. That is my, uh, my apple. Cut it up small. And uh, put the milk on the milk there. What we're going to do now is uh, come over here to the fridge. And what I, I do, sometimes, sometimes I don't, but a lot of times I do, I get uh, ice out about four or five sheets of ice. And there it is. Uh, after that, uh, I like it chewable too. Um, but I've got that all in there. And I have to... No. There's all my apple peelings. But uh, what we're we doing is just, uh, just out the floor we're doing. But, uh, Now my top is getting tracked, so I'm going to put a towel up there so it don't splash out. And we have to plug it in. Thank you. 
I have a lot of foot goes. Um, I thought I'd mix stuff up and it's pretty large. I drink this. But make sure you do not, uh, you know, you wash these things inside the dishwasher and they're hot and then put cold stuff in that will break glass with the FYI. To make these videos short and sweet, but since I'm blending this thing, it's going to take a little bit of time here. Yeah, it's Sometimes I put banana. Um, there it goes. Shut off. I'll let you go ahead and run this. I said pretty long. It's going to have a lot of air. Anytime you blend something like that, you can see all that those bubbles on top. That's from the air. Just mixing air in there. Uh, sometimes I try my best not to use it all in there. There ain't nothing wrong with it. Just use your <laughs> air in your stomach and your, your burp or however. And I'll rinse that out in a minute. But that's it. You saw how thick that was. I shouldn't tell. No. If my camera was on there or not. But that was it. Um, like I said, uh, I put bananas in it, banana and apple and peanut butter. Um, sometimes I use a big uh, tablespoon of honey, and that really makes it good. Honey and apple. Um, sometimes I put pecans in there and just really uh, use it up and put honey in with that. I'm out of honey today, so I'm not adding any honey. But, I pretty much always thought to uh, whatever peanut butter and jelly sandwiches uh, were good, I put it in there. Strawberries. Um, sometimes I use grapes because I want the, the taste of grapes. But uh, that's it. I hope this helps somebody and gives them an idea of what they can eat. God bless.